Welcome to AMFAR's PEPFAR Country and Regional Operational Plan Database. The database is designed to help you access and understand PEPFAR's programs and priorities at a deeper level than was previously possible. This introductory video provides a brief overview of how to interact with the system. You'll find additional information on the About page at the top left. The main page of the database shows that between 2007 and 2014, more than $29 billion were budgeted for PEPFAR programs. The map on the left allows you to view funding by country. The chart on the right shows how funding has been allocated to different program areas. Allocations can also be shown proportionately as percentages by clicking the Show Percent button. The pie chart below shows total funding by organizational type, while on the right you can see trends over time. Further down is a list of the top 30 implementing partners, those that have received the most funding across all countries between 2007 and 2014. You can select an individual year for each partner and get detailed information on a partner by clicking on the name. Let's go back to the top and dig deeper into the data. If you're interested in funding for, say, Nigeria, just click it on the map, use the menu above, or use the keyword search. You'll find the same basic set of graphs, but just for your selected country. On the left is the breakdown by program area and the right by budget code. Above that, you'll see a link to epidemiological information. This helps put the funding in context and shows what effects it's having. You can also see PEPFAR's targets and results. Let's say you're only interested in Prevention of Mother-to-Child Transmission, PMTCT. Select it from the chart on the right. You'll see that between 2007 and 2014, PEPFAR allocated over $237 million to PMTCT programs in Nigeria. If you now look at the Epidemiology tab, you'll see indicators specific to your selected program. Now this is where the database gets very detailed. If you scroll down to the partner programs, you can see the individual mechanisms that have been funded for PMTCT work in Nigeria. Clicking on the mechanism will bring you to a page describing the program in detail. In this case, you can see that the implementing partner is FHI 360. The mechanism has existed between 2012 and 2014 and is funded through USAID. The pie chart shows the breakdown by budget code and the bar chart shows the level of funding for all known years of the mechanism broken down by program area. Scrolling down, you see that this mechanism has a significant number of subpartners. If you scroll all the way down to the PMTCT budget code, you'll find the specific activities to be undertaken through this grant. One last important feature to note, if you go back to the country page for Nigeria, you can also access a funding timeline. This shows all mechanisms funded between 2007 and 2014, as well as when these mechanisms are projected to end. Remember, these are just projections. So that's our quick introduction. We hope you find the database useful and we welcome your feedback. And again, you'll find additional information on the About page at top left.